Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of City Skylines here in St. Mary. Uh, right now we're taking a little trip in a hearse, going around and picking up some dead people, which apparently, well now this is the back of a bus, we're not really doing anything here. Apparently, there's a lot of dead people in my city, which uh, you'll probably be able to see here in a minute. Oh, you know what? They don't show you the little notifications, but uh, yeah, we're cruising around, picking up dead people. There's uh, an ambulance. Ambulance is all over the place, going to get sick people, uh, all because I think I poisoned and murdered a whole bunch of my citizens just with bad water. So, good on me. Let me snap out of this view and show you. Dead people! Tons of dead people. They're cleaning up this neighborhood slowly. They're starting to work on this one, and I think we're starting to work on this one as well. Uh, it's hard to keep track of them because whenever I click on the cemetery and I click the pathways, it uh, it rarely seems to update. It says there's 12, but it's only showing me one hearse going around. So this guy is just going back to the cemetery. Oh wow, that's freaky. Click. Watch him. Yeah, we'll take a trip back to the uh, to the cemetery. Thank you for not making another dead person by running over that kid. That would have been weird. Yeah. So um, I think instead of growing the city today, I don't want to overtax the already taxed uh, death industry, basically. Um, and instead, what I'd like to do is, uh, you know, make some improvements to our city. So, I think what I want to do, first thing, is put in some additional public transportation. So I'm going to snap back out of that view. Look at these buses go. Buses going nuts. Um, yeah, let's work on some public transportation. One piece of public transportation that I think is very important is a train station. And if you remember in the last episode, we bought this square in order to get highway access to this part of the city, and that's working out great. Uh, but now what I'd like to purchase, or what I'd like to build rather, is basically a train line that comes down and basically serves in between these neighborhoods, I believe. Are these buildings getting abandoned because of what? I guess dead people drive people away? I don't know. Yeah, I would love to get um, like a train station down here somewhere um, and then actually it wouldn't be a bad idea to get a train bridge across the river and to curve it down like back of this neighborhood or maybe here not sure let's just start building and seeing what we end up with I will start by grabbing my rail I want what do I want do I want a hub let's think about this for a second what kind of hubs do we have available bus inner city bus I already built a couple of those metro inner city bus don't have a metro yet. Train Metro Hub. That might be good for actually getting people into the high density areas. Maybe I switch over to a metro in that area. Uh, we've got some trains. Train station with 12 platforms. Each platform can have separate tracks connected. Passengers can easily change lines at the station. Great. I'm not sure I want that. Like, I don't think I need 12 train lines right now. Ferry and bus exchange stop. Don't have ferries. Uh, monorail bus hub. Metro monorail train hub. That's... That's not bad. Metro monorail train. So, here's, oh, 
where are you that you're bothered by noise pollution? Noise pollution making people sick, huh? Let me hear it. All right, so you don't like uh, you don't like being next to a commercial building, is what I'm getting. So I think what's going to end up happening is that, and that, and that, and that. Boop. And yeah, what that means is that you're going to tear those buildings down. And we can build up residential somewhere else. Like in the next development, perhaps. I don't know. Let's move this to here. And then we can zone... What? This? That's okay. Yeah, that'll be good. Okay, back to what I was planning. So what if we did the Metro Monorail Train Hub, or what was it called? Not, not the Metro Monorail Train Hub. It was like the Train Metro Hub. What does this look like? Oh man, that's big. Um, yeah, I would end up doing it like this, but what can I do with that? Man, it's loud. Like I could basically have a train line coming in and then a train like from this direction. Break off the train line. Train line comes here to this station here. And then you can have a train bridge crossing the river to, I guess, another one of these for a metro on this side and a metro on this side. And then you could do you could do a metro monorail train hub over here and end up with a monorail that goes what like up this coast see that doesn't really help me yeah maybe it does all right, I'm going to place this and just see what happens. We will place it... We'll place it fairly close to the end here. Is that a road? Yeah, that's a road. Okay. Let's move it... Like, I'd like it to be here. And just like, ba-boom. And if these people don't like it, then they get to leave. All right, so it looks like I need to move that taxi stand. Taxi stand, you're going to be out there. Move here. Boop. All righty. Uh, can you move back now? Nope, can't move back there. Can't move back there. Where can I put my taxi stand? Um, I mean, I guess I could just leave it here, couldn't I? Like this. Or... Like this. There we go. Taxi stand. Okay. Let's get these people some water. Or terror. 
uh, we need to fix my pathways, which means be gone. Oh wait, no, don't be gone. Well, yeah, kind of be gone because I want, wow, you can actually build little things here? That's funny. I could do that. I won't do that though. So, start with, I want a train line to come in and go just boop right in there. So, train, two-way, space already occupied, no crap, I know. Why is it doing this? I don't understand what the problem is. I don't... Why won't it let me... Connect? Space already occupied. What are you talking about? Okay. I'm gonna do a straight piece to here. Why, why is this not working? What is it doing? Oh, because that is the metro side. You dingus. You ding dong. Whoops, no, don't do that. I want to move, I want to rotate. Put it back. Yeah, now move. There. There. Did that mess up the... Nope, it's still the same thing. Okay, so this is the train side now. And this is the metro side. Maybe I want to move this a little bit further away. Like, I'll move it. Man, it costs me 20 grand every time I do this. We'll do that. And then we'll grab some tree line streets. We'll move it. Uh, you know what? We'll move it two blocks away. There we go. And we'll bring it even more water. There we go. And we'll do... Pause it real quick. Pedestrian Bridge Builder. There we go. This one and this one. Be gone. Yeah, this is actually pretty good. Okay. Yeah. Let me just fix my zoning. We'll do office space here. And yeah, we're gonna fix this pathway here. This is what we're gonna do. Yeah, we won't zone that just yet. We'll hold off on zoning that just yet. So yeah, let's build our train line. Yeah, that works. Give me a short 
straight piece followed by what? This, I should follow it here and go up the short part. So let's do that. We'll go here to here. Straight for a bit. I don't want to snap to the actual street yet. I'm gonna go up one like that. I mean, I know that's very high, but we'll get there. And we'll go, why is it not snapping? There. And then we'll go, what, just, I'll just go cross country to the train line, yeah. Maybe that straight one back, actually. Page down. thing here. Well, I guess not. We can't do a real sweeping thing. Let's see. And then if we did the movie mod, and we grabbed all of them. Can I bow all of them in? Nope, can't do it that way. Let's just make it semi believable. I think we did this. You know what, actually, that's not bad. There we go. That's good enough for now. I might change that intersection a bit later in the game, but for now we just pop down and cross the highway and enter into the big old part of the city. On pause. I'm going to lower these down. Let's watch this. Oh, that one clipped through. Yep, hot dogs clipping through. Looking pretty good. Alright, nice and low. Just how I like it. And you kind of just swoosh down in and into the city. Boom. Alright. Allow inner city trains. Certainly. Now to put in some metro stops. Well, here's the thing: we're not going to add. We're not going to put more train going this way. So let's take care of our pathway first. Paths. The nice one. What is this? Oh, we're using park path. Can be just the grid. What is this? Pedestrian bridge. Oh, pedestrian bridge builder. Click. There we go. Don't get hit by the train. And that's your pedestrian path to this hub. Then let's put in some metro. Underground metro station. Elevated metro station. Metro station. Huh, interesting. 
Um, noise pollution 50, 50, 50, 10,000, 30,000, 15,000. Why is this one? Uh, whatever. Upkeep 480, 240, 160. Okay, they're basically the same except for the cost and upkeep. There's no difference in noise pollution or anything. EGADS, man. So that's one station. Let's put in... Man, I wish I could do this, but like rotate it. But I guess I can't. We'll put in a station here. Although I'm not sure that they won't just walk to the friggin' thing. And we'll put in a station... Where? Unrecognized versus recognized. Oh, we lost students. So our college is back down to level one. Great! Good, good. We could put in a station right here next to the... Uh, garden. And then we can view it under the river, basically, and make like a big circle here. So for now, we'll just cram this thing in. We could put this right here. That would not be a bad place to put it. Or do I want to put it... What is that? That's just like a crummy slope too steep. Interesting. Can't put it anywhere on here. Can't put it there. Can't put it there. You're severely limiting my ability to place this places. Alright, here we go. There it is. Okay. So let's build some metro tracks. And we'll go from here underground. I want it to go underground pretty much immediately, but I want it to be a nice, long slope. Click to here, and we'll go curvy bit, snap to earthing, do this. This. That's a nice gentle curve. And then we'll do this. Whoop, glitched out for a second. Keep it underground. Do this. Where am I going? I'm going all the way up here. this to this. How's that? That's not a terrible angle. And then I'll just go straight out of here. Straight, I said. Yeah, we'll just go straight for a bit. I'll get my curve back. Yeah, we'll go almost to the bridge. that and then I want to go from the surface underground again like so that's just ever so slightly too far distance too short you get rid of that one and build this click Alright, there's my high density metro loop. Oh, I've got two uh, cemeteries that are full. I didn't realize I had two cemeteries that were full. I need another cemetery, bottom line. 
Let's just build that real quick. Temporary one right here. Uh, temporary one right. That'll be cool because it'll be like dead people on a hill when you're walking back from the. What's it called? Blimp Depot. Yeah, let's put in Metro Stops. All right, create new line. One, two, three, and back. Man, it's like people can walk over to here. I mean, I guess they could in theory walk over to here, couldn't they? Yeah, we'll see. All right, Metro. Let's see how much people enjoy this. 150 people per train. That's pretty cool. Four people going that way. Let's add a line going the other direction. So we'll start here. Call one clockwise, one counterclockwise, I guess. There we go. So we'll say downtown counterclockwise or anti-clockwise if you're of the English persuasion. Downtown clockwise. Passengers, one. I mean, they're working. And this one, not so much. Interesting. All right, so we've got a train. Where are you going? To Rockfield. Oh, that's what I should do. I'll do a train line and it'll be from here all the way up and around to here. And back. I'd love to see how many people start taking this train. 240 people per train. That is a healthy bit. We'll just do four trains. There's no reason to have more than four trains right now. That's wonderful. Let's see how that shapes up. Now, what I'd also like to do, we've got Metro in the high density area. In the low density area, I would really, what the heck? Are there just buildings flooding here for some reason? Yeah, look at them. Blood water just rolling over this thing. Uh, yeah, so we've got bus lanes. What I would enjoy, I think, what are trolley bus like? Trolley buses require a depot. So in that way, they stink and I hate them. Trolley bus is an electric bus, draws power from red wires. would I do that and not a tram? Noise pollution 75.
noise pollution 50. Same speed for the thing. Upkeep 640. Upkeep 760. It's not enough to really ding us on it. But what I'd love to have. Yeah, see, but having a trolley run through this intersection is suicide. It's the worst. What are you doing? Uploading oh, a dead person, there he goes. Purse holding up traffic. But I could basically. I could run it down this road, essentially. Do a turnaround here. Run it down this road. Up and over, or under, really. And pop out here. Run it down this road to here. And do a turnaround. Is that how I want to do it? What will that get me? That'll get me a connection to the industrial area and the low density residential area, but it doesn't connect this area. I could just turn it and go down here. This intersection is not the end of the world. If I suddenly turned it into a trolley intersection. Because, 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 because. Let me think for a second. I can widen this. If I widen this road, this one, I can make it for trolleys. And then hopefully it will actually handle traffic better here, although I'm not 100% sure. And then what? I mean, ideally we would make a loop and it would be like trolleys down through here and like over to here. Let me think about that for a second. Is there anything wrong with that? Is there anything wrong with that? Keep it small here on this road. Keep it like upgrade the upgrade this road. Yeah, I could do that and make the jump from here to here. Let's start by looking at that. If I bulldoze above ground, this one, does that thing lose access? No, it does not. Great. So that, maybe that's enough space. Or maybe I pop up like over here or in the middle. I don't know. Or maybe I pop up here and turn in. Don't know. We'll figure that out. Let's work on blowing up this intersection. All right. We will select four lane road with tram tracks. So we're going to do tram. We're going to blow this up. Space already occupied. Oh, post office. Post office can get moved. Well, it's going to get blown up anyway, so I'll just move it down here. And then upgrade the road. And then move it. Upgrade, move the small park, even though it is 
it so small. Why does that work? Oh, because it's a small road. Huh. What can I do to make it not totally destroy everything? We can do it here. This is the library. There, what's the park sitch look like? Yeah, I guess that's fine. Yeah, do that. Let's keep going. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Upgrade. And then... Upgrade. And then I can do... Like a big street there. Gosh darn it. Well, I don't want this to be... Huh. Don't want this one to be trolley tracks. There we go. That's a little better. But I do want this one to be trolley tracks. I can do trolley to here. Well, I'll do I'll do small trolley tracks to here. And then small. And then small. I'll do big trolley tracks here. Yeah, to here. And then we'll do small roads. Well, actually we'll go to public transport and we'll do tram track, standalone track with rails for both directions. Click. That's cool, because the cars can't go through there. What are you doing? It's gonna mess up traffic in my whole thing, isn't it? do a little individual street with tram tracks for this stuff do 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 do, do. put in some tram tracks click 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 tram comes up here Big tram track here and here. And then I'll do a little one here, 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 and here. And that'll come from this direction. Standalone tram tracks. Give me that curvy bit. We're gonna say go underground. Here. Uh, to here. this and then we'll say come up to surface come on you can do it you can do it slope too steep all right all right let's back this up underground See, it doesn't like that. So go underground. There we go. Alright, so we lose a little business, but we gain a sweet tunnel. Just does that. Great. Continuous, continuous, continuous. Continuous, continuous. That's the only tunnel I need. 
made this jump goes up here. All right, so now what we need to find is a place for a tram depot. Newsflash, it's big. I'm not gonna put it in the wood area. I'm not gonna put it in the commercial area or this residential area. Where can I put this stinking thing? I might have to put it in the area here. Ugh, what if I, what? What if I what? Ooh, I can put it here. Yeah, we're gonna lose a couple of industry buildings, but that is fine by me. Yeah, just a few industry buildings down. So, all right. Next things next, I want to fix the traffic management things that I blew up doing this. So let's go around and make sure everybody knows what the score is. Everybody, yep, uh huh. Let's say this and this. That one. That one. That one. I want the trolley to yield for the most part, but not always. Definitely there. Uh huh. Yaw. 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 Yield. 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 know what to do here. Cars can't go, so none of that matters. You yield. You yield. That one. This one still applies, I'm assuming. Side street. Side street. Yep. That one yields. Yield, yield, ooh, um, this one yields, and the other ones just kind of turn into a free-for-all for some reason. Come back and give everyone their own turn lane. Uh, you go through, obviously. Actually, you yield too. I just want these people to still be able to go. Good still and good still. Okay. Wait. What? There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Let's check arrows. Get your own arrow, get your own arrow. Yeah, see, that's good. Get your own arrow, get your own arrows. Same here, and here, and here, which actually didn't change. That didn't change. None of these things change. It really only matters at the big roads. So like here, yeah, those arrows didn't change. That's a small road. 
dedicated terrain lanes. Bloop! Yeah, everything else should be good. So I can come all the way up here. And like, these are two small roads, so they're not going to have... Oh, this one. There you go. There's that. And that. That is always straight. Good and good. All right, every, everything's good. That's wonderful. Now, the next thing I want to do is rebuild my crazy pedestrian bridge. So, control B, click, and click. Control B again, and we will get rid of these. Get rid of these. Might have to move my, what's it called? My little tree street thing here. Let's see what I can finagle with it though. We'll grab the pathway. That works. That works. Yeah, slope too steep. So I moved everything over. So let's get rid of these. We'll do uh, give me all grid all the time. We'll do a little bit longer actually. There we go. And then we'll do from here to here. Zoning like that. Great. Now let's put my trees back. Tree. Which one was it? I think it was number one. No, number two. Yeah, it was number two. Line. You're killing me. This is gonna be a whole thing again, isn't it? Click. Click. Can I move you around, please? Uh, down. And then this one. Like that. And like this. And like this. Kind of gets rid of all of them, huh? Not a whole lot of space to play with. But okay. And then we will undo these and undo these. Bulldoze, bulldoze, bulldoze. We still have square ones, which is fine. Good, and then we'll do the same thing over here. So we've got really three spaces. So that means pathway, not elevated, also not underground, to there, to there, uh, dezoning these two and these two, moving these nodes like this, then trees, this one in a line, like so, like so, like so. Look at that. Man, people are loving these walkways even now. 
Look at this, there's still no trees here. How do we get trees back? So close. There we go. That's how you get trees back. Look at this, people going nuts. Individual trees. Putting a couple down, just a few. A smattering of trees, if you will. Put one there. Put a couple there. Okay. Now let's grab the whole intersection and lower it. Wait a minute. Yeah, well, we'll, we'll grab that intersection in a second. Yeesh. That was a bus. Whoosh, perfect. All right, you. Object height, this one. Ba boom Ooh, wait a minute, is that... Is that above or below trolley lines? I don't know. Yeah, that might be... Yeah, that might have trolley lines going through it. All right. Let's raise them up a little bit. Click, click. Click and click. Do it until the trolley lines disappear, I guess. There we go. And there we go. Yeah. There we go. Still good. I gotta stop hitting escape like that. Jeez. Alright, let's add a tram line in. Tram line. Alright, it's a loop. So I would like it to Start here at the what's it called? Blimps are the word I'm thinking of. Start at the blimps. Come down here. One at the end of the block. This block, one at these blimps, I'll have the trolley pull off of the main street because I don't really want them taking up traffic time, and then we'll do across from the bus stop, and across from the bus stop. Bus stop. And complete the line. I'll move that. No, I'll, I'll keep it right there. There, that's the uh, that's the tram line. Let's check on real quick, we'll check on our ooh, passengers doing good. Yep, two of them are being handled. That's the counterclockwise line. The clockwise line's doing the same. Awesome. Uh, bus lines are also doing pretty good. Probably don't need seven buses anymore. The 
that's number seven. Let's just go down the list. Uh, probably need more on this one. Well, maybe not six, but we'll go with five. Bus line three, bus line five. It doesn't need ten anymore. We can probably get away with five. Bus line two. Probably, where do you go? Bus line two, what, like... Show me bus line two. Bus line two goes... Basically... Through the commercial areas. And through the area on the other side of the river. But this one barely ever has any people. Bus line two. I delete a stop without totally deleting the thing? Yes, I can. Bus line two, take a look at it. And then this stop, virtually nobody uses. Everybody uses that station and this stop and gets off here. Weird. Um, yeah, get rid of it. People seem to want to get off there, though, so I kind of don't want to get rid of it. I don't know. Bus line two. Why is it so far now? Like, we still have enough people here to probably warrant having that many buses. Bus line four. That one's still kind of useful. Birch District to the bus stop. Really, it's the bus to Birch District. Does Birch District need a train station? I don't know. Bus line St. Mary's Loop. This is a ton of buses. Like, I don't think we need 18. I think we need, like... 10 or 12. I'll give you 14 now. No, I won't. I'll give you 12. All right, and then bus line number six. This one goes, where does it go? It goes from the central hub down to here. 16, see, but there's all these like empty buses. Like, you need like eight, and you just need to actually pick these people up. So, we'll see. You need train to train. Is it worth it putting a train up to the Birch District? Like, ding ding. And we gotta move our oil industry. Gotta move it, because this mountain is not good for building on. Look at this thing. It's atrocious. Look, look at this. This is dumb. These things are chugging away, though. No idea. And yet, nobody will bring anything to this guy.
you actually going to deliver it? Ayo. Yeah, weird. It's like it'll only import, it won't use the raw products there. I digress. All right. That, I think, is the episode, boys and girls. Look at you. Where are you going? Line details. Yeah, I don't even think we need four trains. But, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll keep it going. It's 127. We did very well with our trains set up. Transporting passengers to Lakewood. Interesting. Well, it seems like we did a good job of setting up some additional uh, public transportation options for our citizens. So, what do I want to go out on? I think I want to go out on a train. I think that would be really cool. I just want one that uh, is mine and is not yeah distance traveled online give me that train <laughs> hopefully it turns around after it gets into the station ah oh, look at this use the whole station it's great A little walking path there look at all these old people on the platform this is funny well, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this episode of City Skylines here in St. Mary's. I know I did. I love, I love the public transportation options in this game. Like, I never done the blimps before, but like they were really fun. I've I've always kind of leaned more heavily on trains and uh, metros and monorails, and trams, etc. So uh, it's it's fun to get back to the things that I like doing and putting them uh, in my city. So uh, I hope you enjoyed it too. Look at the view. This is some alpine stuff right here. Just like uh, mountains in the distance. There's friggin' blimps flying all over the place. You can see my city areas up on the hill. Uh, yeah, this is, this is really nice. Not a whole lot going on the left side of the screen, but hey, we'll get there. Um... Yeah, but if you did enjoy this episode, uh, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, uh, hit that subscription button and ring the bell. Uh, all these things really help me know that you're enjoying the, the work I'm doing, you're enjoying the city, and uh, that you don't mind seeing more, because I don't mind making more, that's for sure. I'll, I'll, Hell, I'll make the videos even if nobody watches, which, frankly, at this point is kind of the case most of the time, but that's all right. I enjoy it for the city building, not for the number of people watching the videos, that's for sure. Look at this. Do a little roundabout, and our train comes down into the city. Blimps all over the place. You can see the whole city stretched out in front of you. That's wonderful. Well... Uh, if you are watching this, I appreciate you. I love you. I hope you're having a wonderful day, and I hope you'll join me next time uh, in City Skylines here in St. Mary. I will catch you then. Peace!